Catherine Jones, and I'm here starting a new segment of my show called Rants. Not because I want to yell at anybody, not because I want to go at Gary Vee and swear at you, but simply because sometimes people say things online that are just so, um, like, it's sad that, like, I just, I feel almost like it's my moral responsibility to address this because it is that bad. So anyway, if you know anything about me, if you've been following me for any amount of time, ever since I've been on the internet, I decided to create what's called a haters folder, anybody that says anything mean to me on the internet. I don't know exactly what my plan is for these comments, but like, I got one today that just cracked me up. <laughs> so I'm making a rant about it, okay? And here we go. We're just going to flip this around. Let me show you what it says. This is a comment that I got on a Facebook ad that I just did from our friend Charlotte here, and this is what she says. And it was about CF Design School. If she knew anything about design or hacking, she'd know that Facebook ads are a bust. Laughing face emoji. <laughs> laughing face emoji. Laughing face emoji. I love when people try and steal my idea of branding. Mm, then try. Mm, make a con artist video on Facebook. I coined the term design hacking a long time ago. You are way, way too young to know anything. All right, Charlotte, I think, I think we're just gonna, we're just gonna address a few things. Okay, um, let's just start at the top here. If I knew anything about design hacking, I'd know that Facebook ads are a bust. Well, this is what I'm saying. I'm just gonna drop some current stats on you. I'm currently getting $1,000 sales for $150 to $250 up front. So in my personal opinion, that's a money printing machine. I put $150 in, it gives me $1,000 back. That is coming from cold Facebook ads. So, mm, it's not a bust, Charlotte. I don't know what's happened in your life with Facebook ads. If you're looking for a great Facebook ads lady, anybody that's not Charlotte, her name's Lisanne Murphy. I'll give you her number. She does great work for me. So, um, that's just hard. And the rant just, that is just blatantly not true that Facebook ads are a bust. I'm here to prove it. So, that's number one. Next thing, I love it when people try and steal my idea of branding and then try and make a con artist video on Facebook. Oh, sweetie Charlotte, where do we begin? Okay, steal my idea in branding. We have looked this lady up online. I'm not exactly sure where she thinks I'm stealing her ideas. Branding, content, all around anything, but that's okay. I do, though, have an insight into why I think she's angry. It's because she loves Photoshop. And here I come along saying, hey, not only can you learn this skill, but you can do it without Photoshop, coding, or any graphic design skills, and make a butt crap of money doing it. I recognize how that would be really frustrating. It, it Literally this week, I've had two different phone calls with people that have gone to school, they're working their dream job, and they are calling me, these are like friends that I know, and are calling me to ask if I, I think my program would be a good fit for them because they hate everything that they have literally spent the last anywhere from four to eight years learning in school. And it's devastating for them to realize that what they have invested in is either no longer pertinent or is not actually fulfilling or is not making them the money they want. It's like a really, it can be a really difficult thing. Charlotte, I bet you're going through something like this where you're like, this sucks. Everything that I've learned is not, I, well, I don't know. I don't know. But here's the great thing. If Charlotte were to, you know, turn her attitude a little bit, literally she could apply what she knows to the principle, do the six of science of design hacking and start making a buck crap of money and get more than her one subscriber that she has on YouTube. That's another thing. So, um, yes, I understand like why maybe she could be mad, but she's a little bit off on that one. Now, the final thing, Oh, she also says she coined the term design hacking. I, I don't even know what to say about I don't even know what to say about that. So other than do a Google search for her name and design hacking and you'll find nothing. Okay. The final one and I love this. You are way too young to know anything. First of all, Thank you for noticing my youthful glow. That is something I've been working on and thank you so much. Secondly, I'm 28 years old. Thirdly, I'm gonna be honest, I literally just went to an event where I spoke with entrepreneurs who are making millions and millions of dollars and are having tens of millions of YouTube views, subscribers, who are literally under the age of 16. So, I think anybody who says you're too young to know anything, 
Like, it's not even that you're dumb. It's, 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 like, it's not that you're dumb. It's not even that you're wrong. Like, it's, it's just, like, it's not a fact. Like, you're, like, I guess it, like, you're just wrong. Like, people way younger than me, half of my age, are absolutely crushing it. So, anyway, I thought this one was, like, kind of fun and kind of just came in heated. And I was like, oh, yeah, she's angry. Let's make a video. So, anyway, this is to you, Charlotte. I hope you know that we'd love to have you if you ever decide to change your mind about being mad about things. Inside the world design hacking, it's a great place to be. Just know that anybody else, if you think Facebook ads are a hoax, well, that's wrong. If you're mad because you've spent a lot of time learning something and other people are killing it, just know you can be mad about it or you can just join the bright side and come earn a butt crap of money and you're never too young or too old to learn anything. So Charlotte, thank you so much for inspiring this episode of A Rant. Um, so sorry you're mad. Not sorry enough to change anything. Bye!